told the story there, is could you protect your wife? Right? Or could you protect your family or your, or your partner? Or, you know, could you protect your wife is really aimed at the guys? Because the guys all go, of course I could! Right? The guys always go, you know what I do? I kill them! <laughs> and then all the guys do, if anyone touch my wife, I kill them. And guess what happens when they actually get attacked? Hmm? Yeah, if they run, leave the wife to that's what you're doing. <laughs> but the truth is, everybody, and I'm, on, I'm saying this on purpose, of course everybody wants to. Everybody believes they would. And by the way, I'm just saying, is this could be anyone, could you protect your mother, could you protect your kids, could you protect your friends? Most people say, of course I would. And most people then have what we call the fantasy response. If someone did that to me, what I would do is this. Then things go and happen, and guess what happens? <coughs> you have no idea, because most people haven't trained for it. What happens, we don't know. We had a guy yesterday, who basically he was walking through Temple Bar in the day with his wife, and somebody grabbed his wife by the back of the head, and the next thing he knew, he had the guy on the ground, in, 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 pinned, and, you know, and started to, then started to move away. And he says he had no idea what happened? He had heard his wife scream. Next minute, he's down the corners and he caught something. Next minute, he moved and got this guy down. That happened because the guy trained. He prepared himself. Because here's the thing you never have a choice. People always say, I assume well, this will happen and I will decide what to do. You don't have a choice. Because what we teach is what you do when you don't have a choice.